Hello guys and happy Sunday to all of your sunshiny faces. Guys, it is only 11.15 and I started the vlog today, so it is good morning. <laughs> um, we went out this morning at like 8 o'clock and went grocery shopping and I just got the fridge all cleaned out and did the dishes so that I had room to put away all of the groceries that we got today, which I'll share with you guys in just a second. But basically, um, like every single Sunday, except for last Sunday because we didn't get a chance to go grocery shopping, I clean out the whole fridge with like any leftovers and um, all the Tupperware and stuff like that and wash it all because, you know, whatever we sitting in the fridge needs to be washed now so I got all of that done and all the dishes are cleaned now and then um, I'll I have a clean fridge to put all of these stuff you know into whatever produce went bad or whatever um, toss that so that um, you know I have room to put everything away so we spent I don't know what my dad spent at Menards but I think we spent right around like 150 which was a little bit more money but um, there was a few things that I got that I needed <laughs> um and then too there was a lot of my mom's snack stuff too this week and like i got a lot more snack stuff than i normally get but the problem was i forgot to get the um soups that i normally get so that's kind of i guess i'll offset that because normally i have like a soup for lunch or something like that or like snack stuff for lunch but i got stuff to make um my instead of doing the soups i got stuff to make my favorite um like little they're like uh mozzarella spinach cheese melt melts kind of like almost like a grilled cheese but it's with um tortillas and then you fry it it tastes so good it's like my favorite so it gets the cheese all melty it's like a grilled cheese pretty much but you put it in a tortilla and you use spinach and mozzarella cheese i think the recipe that i use for it is calls for a different type of cheese but i always use mozzarella i love it i think you could use provolone probably too but I prefer it with mozzarella at least I haven't tried it with provolone but I like it with the mozzarella so it's fine so I'll share with you guys everything I got this week um there's a candle that was sitting on the table that I just put stuff around in the curing too so um I'll share with you guys we did get a lot of produce stuff but there was also a lot of snacky stuff that we don't normally get in here like two things that have peanut butter bars Nutri-Grain bars um one is for my mom one is for me of these my dad also picked up six yogurts for this week um let's see i'm just gonna go over the snacky stuff i guess my mom got veggie chips and pretzels i think she's going to make a um uh what's it called uh like trail mix with the pretzels and then she also got uh m&ms in there too and then i got a thing of these cheddar puffs for myself and then one for me and one for matthew of the baked penguins so yeah that was kind of like the snacky stuff that we ended up getting for this week i guess and then um my mom also got some whole almonds in there as well, which were like pretty expensive. They're like five fifty or something, like that, or four fifty or something, um, which for almonds is normally pretty expensive. Any nuts are normally expensive, but um, anyways, though I am making um, three or four dinners this week, and then I also kind of have a fifth, I guess, kind of. Um, but I am going to do that possibly make it for myself or maybe make it for everybody but i'm not sure how it's gonna go we also too for tonight we got, we got two big pizzas of the deli pizzas a cheese one and a pepperoni or sausage or something like that i'm not sure what this one is it is a philly cheesesteak pizza which sounds pretty good i'll go over like i said everything we got this week i got 10 of the golden delicious apples i got three plum tomatoes i believe they are and then i also got all all different types of um bell peppers there's i got three reds one big orange or one big yellow and two smaller oranges and two um, medium sized green ones and then i also got two small zucchinis in there i also got some organic onions pears lettuce cauliflower i got a lot of broccoli because two recipes this week i'm using broccoli for and i wanted to use fresh instead of frozen so i got a bunch i'm also going to steam one probably for the dinners this week i got four lemons two things of uh plum grape or grape tomatoes two things of organic ones and then over here i got a little thing of kiwis uh eggs which were 50 cents each at uh, caputo's and it was a limit of two so i'm going to do a quiche this week since they were so cheap for dinner i also got um i believe they're organic avocados i think i got four or five in there maybe six possibly yeah six and then i got the mozzarella cheese like for those melts i was talking about my mom's m m's i also got these mini semi-sweet chocolates which um i'll probably use a little bit for um my fakey starbucks coffee that i make in the mornings 
um, and then also two uh, for those the breakfast like the clean eating breakfast blender muffins um, I'll probably use some of these too I'm not sure if I'll make those that this week but I possibly could um, and then also the refried beans if not though I have all the ingredients for it and I don't have to go out and buy it we got two things of salsa there's one over here one over there one for me and one for my mom um, I'm going to do the I'm gonna do the nacho bell peppers again and then I also picked up two of these two which were springy ones uh, spring like cupcake liners for for those muffins or just to have these because we're out and then also a thing of the romaine hearts the tortillas I also got a thing of shrimp which I'm doing a shrimp dinner for t this week and then uh, Italian dressing the almonds a medium-sized watermelon four packets of ranch because sometimes I like to use recipes they'll call for ranch packets and I never have them on hand so I think I need one for this week but I have three extras or maybe I need one or two for this week pretzels like I said I believe for trail mix a small garden salad two things of shredded or um two things of chunk cheese three cucumbers cream cheese Coke, which I will explain in a second what I'm using that for. Uh, whole grain white bread, macaroni and cheese, also explain what I'm using that for. Um, bananas, pork loin, which I wasn't planning on getting the pork loin. Um, it's a long story. I They didn't have the butt roast at Aldi. They had a gigantic one and they only have one left and so I went with going with pork uh, pork loin roast I'm going to do pulled pork sandwiches which is what I use to marinate I use the coke kind of like to marinate it I don't know um, but it's like a coke but it's in the crock pot and everything like that so I've done it several times before I actually have a video up on the other my other YouTube channel if you guys want to check that out but I got that for that and then also I guess my mom needs cheese slices chocolate syrup again for the for the at home Starbucks cafe and then also uh, half and half I need for a recipe heavy whipping cream which I'm gonna also need for the Starbucks stuff for this week which I got a few of those things like this we're out of I'll probably use like a tiny little bit of it for this week and then I'll have a ton left over you know probably last me the whole month or more um, and then also my dad got these I got the spinach again for those melts this um, the pie crust which I'm doing two different types of like I said I'm doing a quiche and then I'm also going to do macaroni like pie bake kind of thing um, I don't know if I'll just do that for myself or if I'll actually make it as a dinner or something um, and then minced garlic because we are out again the salsa I got two things of raspberries the penguins the cheddar puffs uh, we're out of French vanilla creamer, the barbecue sauce, which again is for the pulled pork sandwiches, panko breadcrumbs, hamburger buns again for that, um, for the sandwiches, and then honey, which we are out of as well. If, uh, several things this week we were out of because we didn't go grocery shopping last week and I realized I needed some of those. So like that was one of them and then the Italian dressing too. Uh, gala apples and I believe that is it. We've made it full circle. So yeah, that is what we got for this week. We also got a thing of Diet Coke for my mom and then also a thing of water too, which obviously I didn't share with you guys, but that is already put away. So now I get the uh, pleasure of putting all of this stuff away in the nice clean fridge. So guys, I'm gonna make those cheese melts um, and basically I I just Matthew can you keep it down <laughs> um, I'll share with you guys how I make them basically I'm gonna make two um, but first off I want to share with you guys right so this mozzarella cheese which isn't the same as provolone but the provolone is the same price at Aldi for the eight ounces the 11 slices of the mozzarella cheese and or provolone I think cheddar cheese a few different other types Swiss cheese or whatever right it's a dollar ninety nine that's for a half a pound, which is eight ounces, and 12 or 16 ounces is the full pound. So a full pound of sliced slicing provolone cheese is $2.99. You figure if you got a half a pound, that would end up being a dollar fifty, which is fifty cents cheaper than getting this. And plus it's two, it's the fresh deli stuff instead of this, which I think is a better deal personally. So I never even realized that. I always thought like the deli slice um, cheese was always expensive, but realizing it's actually cheaper than buying this pre-deli sliced stuff at Aldi, which I'm going to do from now on now that I realize the price. But yeah, anyways, just wanted to share that with you guys. If it's around that price, normally you probably, even if it was like $3.99 a pound, it still end up being the same price as getting two of these, which is cheaper. So <clears throat> 
Anyway, so how I make these basically is with these, fold them in half, and then I put the the mozzarella cheese in there, and then the baby spinach in there, and then fry it up. I'll show you guys how it lo that looks afterwards. So here we go, I'll fry it up. The cheese is all nice and gooey, and we got the spinach in there, and these are delicious. So I'm gonna have me two of these, but I used to make these all the time. I haven't made them in so long, so I'm so, so excited I get to try these out again. So guys, I thought I'd share with you a little renovation project-y thing going on in here. Um, I guess it's, we're just relocating rooms, kind of, because this used to be Matthew and Jack's old room. Look at this dog. She thinks I'm talking to her. <laughs> Um, this used to be Matthew and Jack's old room, and now that they're upstairs, is going to be my mom and dad's office and, like, a sitting room kind of thing in here as well. So, um, that bed still has to go upstairs. It's the other bunk to Jack's bunk bed, which he, Matthew has my grandma's old bed. She got a new bed from Ikea that now fits in her little apartment. Matthew, so Matthew got her old bed, which was a queen, I think, or something like that. And then that, Jack has one of the bunk beds upstairs, and this was the other one. So this is actually the bottom one and then um, he's going to probably sleep on the bottom or whatever and then the top one will be for like if his friends come over and sleep over or and or just for like stuffed animals and stuff like that. So just to have like an extra bunk if a friend comes over or even two if Matthew's friend ends up coming over they'll have an extra bunk for them. Um, so yeah that's this room kind of. It does of course need to be repainted in the floors too. <laughs> you guys can't tell. And then out on the back porch my dad um, cleaned off the whole back porch pretty much and um it still kind of needs to be like like hosed down because you guys can tell there's still like mud and stuff there but those are the chairs that my mom picked up from the thrift or from that uh estate sale for 13 bucks for the two of them and she's gonna re-spray paint them but for right now we just threw them on the back porch and then our porch swing which is out there it's always been there but um the grill which that is gonna go because we are getting a new um grill this summer and so that was pretty much what um, my dad ended up doing outside. Um, and so the back porch, which looks super cute pretty much. Um, I mean, we have a small little back porch, but, you know, it's like a cute little back porch that, you know, we can sit at and everything. So that's what happened um, in these two rooms today because Matthew also brought my mom's. This is supposed to go in her room and she's going to use it as like a vanity. Um, and so it's not that's not staying in here that's going to go in her room but then my dad my mom's desk might go here my dad's desk might go there and then another desk probably over here and then the sitting area or something i'm not sure how they're planning on it but then my closet is in here got all my stuff because my bedroom doesn't have a closet so that's pretty much what everybody has been up to today and then the fear the walking dead starts in about 15 minutes and um, Matthew is actually upstairs because I believe Game of Thrones starts and my dad has the first two seasons so Matthew's re-catching up on it before the night before well the season starts tonight I guess but Matthew's just gonna re-watch it um and so they were like oh Kayla you need to watch it too and I was like you don't get me guys I binge watch okay like I'm gonna watch probably all four or five seasons or whatever it is in like three days okay <laughs> my dad was like oh well I'll get the seasons once you get there like he'll buy the other two seasons or three seasons they don't have and I was like no 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 you don't get it I'll watch all of it in three days so um yeah I don't like having to wait for things like so I was like if you want me to start watching it I'm gonna watch it like now I mean unless I really 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 don't like it but I don't see why I wouldn't because Matthew and my dad have told me plenty about it that I'm pretty sure I would actually probably like it but anyways yeah that's what Matthew's doing and then like I said Fear the Walking Dead it's going to be on in about 15 minutes but we are watching that live and then my dad and Matthew recorded um what you call it the the Game of Thrones so they can watch it later but this dog I believe she wants to eat so that's what you need right we also have to go check out Matthew and Jim. oh what you want to eat eat <laughs> okay, quiet. <laughs> Guys, I took a shower and everything, and I forgot to end the vlog for tonight. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, we didn't actually end up watching The Walking Dead because Matthew was on a cleaning kick and wanted to get all of his cleaning done, so we said we'll watch it tomorrow. So, the Fear the Walking Dead 
um, we'll watch that tomorrow. And then my dad ended up, I think, watching Game of Thrones. But I think Matthew's going to actually wait until he rewatches all of the seasons again to start watching it, like, from the beginning, I guess, I think. I'm not sure. But that sounded like kind of what he was thinking. If not, he's just going to watch the episode tomorrow. Like, he knows what's going on, but he just wants to rewatch it, I guess. So, um, anyways, yeah. Uh, I watched The Family, though, on ABC, which I normally end up watching, like, the next day or so because we record it because I normally fear The Walking Dead is my priority on Sunday nights. So then if I can't watch that, then I'll watch The Family. And my dad's next priority, then, is, um, is Game of Thrones. So, uh, but my dad watched it. Matthew just kept clicking kept on cleaning so he got um most of his room cleaned and they should move jack's bed i think sometime they'll probably have to move it up by next weekend because matthew might not have enough time this week to do it but anyways though guys yeah that is actually when it ended up happening so tomorrow we're watching fear the walking dead but it might have to be um a little bit earlier only because uh We've got the Blackhawks game, game seven on tomorrow, um, and I think it's like 8.30 or something like that, so that's going to be a late, late, late night again, but I will see all of you guys in tomorrow's vlog. If you guys did enjoy today's, so make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up. If you guys are new, we'd love if you'd subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys all in tomorrow's vlog, so bye guys. And also, too, today, my parents ended up picking up this chair that I'm sitting in because it is the literally the softest, fluffiest, big chair on earth. It is so comfortable. And it matches with the carpet, too, that we got from the other day. And it matches Bliss. Does it match you? <laughs> Look at her. She's like, can you get it off of me? Look at you. You're so precious. Oh, so cute. And then also, too,